Today is Thursday, May 19th. It's approximately 5 o'clock in the afternoon. Roscoe and I stopped in Hosford and uh, the sun started peeking up a little bit so I looked for a park and I found this one here. I guess we've been here probably three or four hours now. We plugged our phones in. Really nice bathrooms, they were actually even open, which just surprises me coming from St. Petersburg where everything is just so crazy. But, uh, we washed a little bit of clothes in the sink, cleaned up a bit, charged all our stuff. Nobody's been here all day long. I don't know why this surprises me so much. I guess I've just gotten so grown used to the city. The city's so cold compared to some of these smaller towns. But uh, this is a beautiful park. They have a concession stand up there. They have a football field. They have a couple baseball diamonds. Trail that runs around the park. Playground for kids over here. And it looks like Here's they just put in brand new grills. These things don't even look used yet. A little big for Roscoe and I, so we'll probably let someone else christen them. There's one over there. So anyway, we've got to do some organizing here. As I mentioned at our last stop, we got this really cool military backpack and uh, it hangs off the back of the bike almost perfectly. Lots of space there for lots of stuff. But, uh, leaves Roscoe a lot more room on the inside. We generally emptied out the inside with the exception of the blankets for him to ride, but uh, sometimes you just couldn't get it all out and it was just stuffy in there for him. But now, now he jumps in there with a smile on his face and he just chills. Anyway, it's a fantastic day here, fairly cloudy, it's hot out, but not sunny, that sure helps. Nice breeze, Roscoe got to play in the hose, Roscoe did you play in the hose, huh? And he found some balls, watch this, you want to see a knucklehead cheer up, watch this, wait till he sees these. What? what? What, you want that? Huh? You want that? Get it. Get it. <laughs> Roscoe, look at this one. Go get it. Yeah, that just made his day. Dad, I'm gonna chew on some balls while you... Can you catch this? Huh? Be careful, it's a little hard. Oh, good boy. Anyway, why don't you chew those up while I organize? Hi, huh, kiddo? I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. It's never too hot to play ball, Dad. Never too hot to play ball. Give me kisses, Roscoe. Roscoe, kisses. Kisses. Huh? You do it? You get the phone? No? I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. Ah, no, you ain't. I'm gonna get the tail. I'm gonna get the tail. I'm gonna get the tail. Anyway, that's that. Nice day, very peaceful. Feeling really good today. Tomorrow, we in another town. I like this, we uh, take a few hours, sleep a few hours, relax a few hours. And uh, it's really neat getting to know the different personalities in all these towns. People here are very friendly also. I would suggest everybody get the hell out of the cities. You'll learn that there are uh, some truly decent people in the world. Not that the people in the cities aren't, but most of them are scared and they're fearful and they tend to react rather than respond and 
know, it just, uh, just snowballs and makes it worse and worse and worse for everyone because, uh, just too many people in too little of an area. Nobody has personal space. It's hard to find anybody that respects personal space. You come out here in the country or you drive or ride your bike several hundred miles through the country, you start to realize there's no need for everybody to be living in shoe boxes in the city when there's just so much space out here. And you come out here, it's, it's amazing. Like, I could probably spend the night here and nobody would say a word. And probably if the police or anybody showed up after they talked to me, they'd be just like, oh, okay, yeah, no worries. If you need anything, let us know. In St. Petersburg, phew, man, you even think about being in any of those parks after dark, you're going to get an argument. They're no fun anyway. I mean, they they have no electricity. In many cases, they don't even unlock the bathrooms anymore. They just leave them locked all day long. And uh, you're lucky if you can find a hose that works. So... Hosford, I could live here. I could live in several of the towns that we've been through. I think. Hell, I don't know. I guess I could live anywhere I'm at. It's uh, strange once you start living like this, though. You you enjoy it when you're there, and then you start to get an itch, and it's time to start pedaling again. Roscoe! That tail don't stop when he has a ball in his mouth, I'm telling you. He's a knucklehead. Want some of this? Do you want some of this? Huh? You don't want none of this. <laughs> Happy dog. Anyway, y'all, checking in, checking out. Have a great evening, and we'll look forward to posting again. Good night.